2022. I have tried to do this video over and over and over again since like maybe the third. Just uh, kind of struggling like what should I talk about? But I am in a better place. I was stuck in like a place of limbo, not deep depression or dark depression, but definitely a light depression. So um, I'm just waking up for this morning. I lit my candles to just set a mood. I do have to work today, but I'm just going to share with you um, my today, a new mindset, a new I'm ready for 2022 to accomplish so many goals and um, check off so much stuff in my life this year. And one of my uh, main goals and journeys for this year will be trying to conquer the K-1 visa process for me and my fiance. So with that being said, um, I'm going to be taking the next uh, several weeks to just get in shape for the second personal one-on-one um, -on -one visit with my fiance. Um, I was 213 last time I went and I just weighed in at 213.2, which is great because my weight had fluctuated a lot during the holidays as you can see i've got a lot of double chinage we're trying to get here all right before i go we want to get rid of all of this and flatten out this belly and get these glute muscles back going because they was kind of popping but now i haven't really been doing anything so that muscle is continual continuously burning calories and i'm extremely muscular in my legs and my butt so one, I'm not exercising on a normal basis or if I do too much cardio and not enough weight lifting, my butt and my legs are like the first thing to go. And that's a no-no as a woman, so we gotta get that right. But um, yeah, so I'm excited about today. And this is really the first time I can honestly say that since 2022 started, that I'm excited about today. I'm excited for this weekend. Um, every weekend I was just start doing self care Saturdays. Sorry if that was there the entire video. I don't know, child. I just woke up. But um I'll start doing self care Saturdays um every Saturday or at least once a week because my schedule did change a little bit uh for next week. But all in all, I love you guys and Let's get into my reset, starting out reset routine for 2021. I mean, 2022, geez. See, still trying to stay there. So this is me checking my weight. I wanted to do this on video so y'all are with me where we starting at. And if my gown get out of the way, <laughs> 213 pounds and two ounces. I found these in a Dollar Tree. Um, and that's just something to help with my mental to catch a vibe. What? What's happening? Okay. I'm going to add some lemon juice to here. Or you can cut up fresh lemons to go inside your ward. I'm going to put a lot. Because I like it to be strong so it can really do a lot for my body okay i'm gonna start my meal prep for today when i gotta go to work this is uh leftover rice from the other day i cooked and some leftover black eyed peas so i'm gonna prep one of my meals is that okay so i gotta go to work uh i'm normally off saturday and sunday but um i switch days with well someone switch days with me so that they can have some time off so uh, this is half of the black eyed peas and a cup of rice and then what I did with the other container that had it in I just added a cup of rice so one I'm taking to work to today on Friday and then this one I'll take to work on Sunday so just a lot of protein and uh, 52 carbs because it's rice and today I'm going to take these leftover greens everything's cold by the way if y'all like what in the world it's cold so you know the fats and stuff have um just kind of solidified around the two dishes because they do have like uh butter and stuff in them but um yeah so i'm taking this to work for today that's my dinner meal for today so i'm just gonna use some stuff that i already have in this smoothie because i go grocery shopping sometimes next week um i use the remainder of the mixed berry blend 
and then I opened up the strawberry to blueberry mango and added that um, as you can see I have uh, coconut chunks in there uh, it was just a leftover of this I'm gonna use um, some of this coconut water with pulp as my liquid and just the remainder of this little bit of slim fast I know a lot of people are not crazy about, about slim fast but honestly I grew up off of it and you know I'm an 80s baby so my mom drunk this and it was it was actually cool and it's full of vitamins and what really put me on i bought it one time because i was just like i you know oh slim fast i miss slim fast so i decided to buy it and i took it i worked really late and at the time i was working uh both my jobs and so i took it like late that night when i got off of work and when i tell you i was so energized the entire day and i was like okay this is a tea so um i just like it now I, and that was the chocolate at the time the vanilla is cool it really is good inside of muffins and stuff and cakes as well it bring out the flavor but um just really packed with a lot excuse my container if it looks a little messy a lot of vitamins all right i'm fixing a blend Okay, so I'm going to pair my smoothie with some eggs. I normally do three just for uh, my particular weight. That's what fills me up. So I'm going to take them and crack them and mix them up with some salt and pepper. And probably scramble those or flat fry them in some olive oil. So in light of February, I decided to use my little Valentine uh, glass that my kids gave me a long time ago. Um, I have my three scrambled eggs with salt and pepper here. And my strawberry mango blueberry coconut smoothie okay I'm about to get into this workout so um grow with Joe just put out a new video like yesterday it's a 10 minute full body workout for teens at home I'm gonna do that as a warm-up and then I'm gonna focus in on you said I got my free weights back there my little five pound dumbbells I'm gonna focus on my glutes and my abs and um, probably squats to get these legs back activated because I really want my legs and my bottom half to get thicker. Um, I'm an apple shape. So even when I was in high school and even uh, slim at maybe like 155, I've always been pretty straight up and down, not many hips or anything. So I definitely want to uh, build my lower half and slim my top half and I'm not quite sure the approach I'm gonna take on that but I do know um, if you just continue to get in shape your body like once it gets rid of all that fat and it starts to build muscle it's going to be the way God intended it to be but you you can definitely um, focus on bodybuilding you can't target where you're gonna lose fat so much you know you just have to exercise and it comes off but and eat right <laughs> but you can definitely target weight training somebody only works on their arms you know they have huge arms and everything else slim so it's the same thing with any other muscle group okay i just finished up the 10 minute grow with joe i'm gonna actually crank up some music and just uh do some of my own moves as well because um that's gonna help get me a good sweat so i started at <laughs> maybe 10 50 or something like that or 10 40 something it's no 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 don't quote me on that 11 50 it's now 12 o'clock i feel like i'm gonna probably just work out until i get really really tired which is normally like 45 minutes to an hour and i'll show you when i grab my free weights and some of the ab moves that i'm gonna use uh since i have that diastasis recti i don't want to continue to make that worse by doing like a forward crunch i have to crunch more so with the bottom half of my body like leg lifts and things of that sort and bicycles okay so now i'm fixing to get my five pound dumbbells these are it so i'm gonna do um with both dumbbells up for about 25 sets and then i'm gonna do some this uh bicep curls and then you extend your arm all the way out and just bring the dumbbell up 
to hit your triceps. So I'm gonna do about 20 to 25 of those a piece on both arms, and then I'll be doing some leg lifts and bicycle curls. So another thing I was slacking on towards the end of 2021 is my collagen and hair, skin, and nail vitamins. I'm starting that back up this year. Um, like I said, I didn't, I don't feel like I completely fell off 2021, but I definitely was neglecting my physical self, just rushing and getting to work, trying to make sure my baby have everything for college, me graduating. It was a lot going on. Okay, so I'm excited about this. I got this particular tea at the Dollar Tree, but just any type of herbal tea um, with no sugar in it, it really helps with digestion and making you feel great. So, of course, I had my beans and rice earlier. For this particular day, a peanut butter and jelly sandwich and a Quest protein bar was my snack. In all, I had two snacks and three meals. This is the last one, which is like some chicchetti and green beans with mushrooms. I didn't end up eating all of my prep, but this is a good start to 2022, you guys. See you next week. Mm -hmm.